Oh, look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. <laughs> Hello, Hi guys. So last night was the VMAs. Um, I caught a little bit of the beginning where people were going in, so I saw a few of the outfits. Trent stayed up and watched it um, till like four o'clock in the morning while yeah. I was sleeping. I know, I tried really hard. We did watch, we did see a lot of the red carpet outfits yeah. in motion. So it, I think that was really good because when we see photos, sometimes photos aren't the most flattering. Um, they look better in different angles. Yeah, and stuff like that. so I'm glad that we saw a lot of them yeah. on video because then we can go, actually, that looks better when we're watching the video yeah. so we know. And we've done um, a video like this a little while ago where we just sort of maybe judged people's outfits. Well, not judge them, just say if gave we liked them or not. Yeah. Gave our opinion on them, so that's what we're going to do again today. Yay! Let's get straight on into it. Who's first? Okay, so first we're starting with Alyssa Violet. Now, Alyssa Violet is part, was part of Team 10 and this whole like Jake Paul YouTube tobacco, you know, all the diss tracks. Um, so, in other words, she's a YouTuber, and um, I think she looks epic. Looking at the picture, it does look a bit like a basic dress, but um, we actually saw it last night on uh, TV, and she looked gorgeous. Yeah, she looks really, really good, and like, it's so flattering. Yeah. That whole middle part there just looks like a wrap around like a corset, yeah. but it's not. It's yeah. kind of like... Kind she looks of a bit like a Bond girl. Yeah, she does actually. Yeah. But she looks really glamorous, and I feel like with the VMAs, there's not really a... Um, I don't think there's really a set outfit. No, I noticed, um, I noticed loads of guys were in tuxedos, but then some of the guys were in caps and trainers. Yeah, like, there's, <laughs> there's no kind of, uh, because team choice, you think, oh, fun, summery, yeah. I can go in shorts. And then Oscars, you think, I need to wear a gown. Yeah. Well, VMAs doesn't really have that kind of stigma of what you really have to wear, the mm. theme. So you can kind of go either way, and I think this is epic. Yeah. Um, so for this, I give her a 4.5 out of 5. I give her a four. Okay, I okay. like it. Okay. So next is Nicki Minaj. Um, I do like this outfit, but um, <laughs> I don't want to be rude. Say it. But like, I know what you're thinking. She has got a bit of a camel toe going on. She does. If that's what she's going for, then she's really succeeded. And I did notice that on the TV as well. Yeah. I was hoping, because in the new Katy Perry song uh, where she features in, she looks amazing. So I was hoping she was going to do something similar. Um, but she looked good. And I, think she had, I think she had a few outfit changes. So this wasn't it. Um, but it's, she looks nice, it's yeah. very, very different. Nice. It's very on brand, exactly. Um, I just was expecting, I don't know, a bit more glam from her, because I know she's gone more down the glam route recently, so I wanted to see something a bit more She does look a bit carpet. like a deal, though. She does. Yeah. More of a, a bit of a sex doll, but you know, yeah. that's kind of her vibe, so... True. I'm living for it. I give it a... Just a four out of five, just. I give it a three. Okay, when I saw this on TV, I literally gasped. Like, I was like, because it was like the camera was going down to up, and I was like, yeah, it's cream. This is uh, model Alexandra. I can't remember, that's really bad, but she looks epic. I think she looks really cool. Mm. Again, like we said before, I think it looks better. It was, I think it looks better in real life than in the picture, um, but she did look amazing, and it's very different, and I loved it. Yeah, it's, I do like that it's kind of tight everywhere, but it's also kind of a dress, but it's tights and their shoes at the same time, and yeah. it's just this whole thing. She looks cool. Yeah, I'm living for it. She looks bad I give her a 4.5 out of 5. I gave her a 4. So, this is really bad, because I don't know who this is, but I think she's really big in America because she did the uh, pre-performance as well and everyone seemed to know who she is and I feel stupid for not knowing who she is. Is she uh, the one that we thought sounded like Nicki Minaj? Yes. <laughs> uh, but she also presents an award. So she is really big in the US, I think. But we just don't know who we she is. We just don't know. It looks good. It, I feel like it could fit a little better, maybe, in certain, in certain spots. Yeah, I think but I would actually prefer it about that big shawl. You think? Yeah. No, I think then it would make it look really basic. Imagine really? it without, it just look like a corset and white pants. Oh, it's pants? Yeah, it's pants. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sorry, I thought it was like a dress. No. Uh, but I think it's still nice. I give it a three out of five. I give it a two. Okay, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Next up is Katy Perry, the host of the evening. Um, I really like it. I really like it as well. I do. I think the pitch is a little bit... Yeah, the picture itself isn't very good, and like again, it was better seeing it in motion. Yeah. Um, I really like the architecture of the design, I think it's really nice. Mm. I would have liked a longer train, just because really? why not? Yeah, because you've got this whole flap over here, mm. it's, just, it's the same size as the kind of... I'd like to know the design of the dress, because it reminds me of um, the Celine Dion dress where she has the big puffy shoulders, and that was I see that. as well. Yeah, but it's really finger hugging and it looks really nice on her. It's really, um... I like it. Yeah, she I looks hot. It. Yeah, I give her a uh, four and a half out of five. I give her four and a half out of five. Okay, good. We're on the same page. We're on the same wavelength. 
This is Mel B right here. I'm not living for it. I'm not living for this either. I don't like her hair. I don't like the dress. I I think the dress is okay. It's like... What does it say? You will never own me. Ooh. Maybe she's making a statement. I don't know. But the shoes go because it starts with red on the top. So she's not like, you know, and she doesn't have sparkly so it's too much. So I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I don't think it's like a disaster. No, it's not a disaster, but it's just not great. Yeah, I think I would have, <laughs> I know. I mean, it kind of reminds me of Scary Spice. So it's on brand for that. I think her hair, I would have liked it more slick. I wouldn't think it would look better slick back than- If maybe she had like a tight ponytail and a long uh, pony, but yeah. Maybe, yeah. But it's okay, I give it a two out of five. I give it a one out of five. Jesus Christ. I'm allowed my own opinion. Okay, whatever you say. This is Jared Leto. Is it? Yeah. Oh my god, I, I don't look like him. I know. I don't know what he's wearing, but not in a bad way, like, I wonder if he takes it off and it becomes, I don't know, like... I think it's just a normal outfit underneath, but I always find it decent when guys are just not wearing a black suit. Yeah. I'm pretty interested. So he's made the effort, like, if I was ever lucky enough to go to one of these things, then I would, like, go all out. I would not be wearing a tuxedo or yeah. black. I would be wearing, like, I don't know, the coolest jackets like yeah and like really cool shoes yeah i just like when guys really colorful stuff because it's really annoying when girls get to wear amazing gowns and sparkling yeah. guys girls are lucky. i know i'll probably go in drag actually <laughs> i would too i always think i always want to just go on a really nice ball gown yeah me too just, just like, like big stiletto like... shoes yes anyway i give him a three out of five same yeah we have Gigi Gorgeous, um, who I'm a big fan of, and Great I think fun. she looks amazing. She looks really good. She looks hot. I love her hair, iron flat. Um, also, this looked um, better again in real life, because I was then. <laughs> I like her shoes that she's wearing with this outfit. Yeah. Um, you can really wear whatever shoes when you've got a full white gown yeah. type thing. It's so tight on her body, it hits every spot, her boobs look insane. I'm not surprised though because she knows exactly how to dress for her figure. Yeah. And she looks amazing. And when she turned, she had a big like dip in her bum and she looks really good. Yeah, she's had curls for days. Yeah. For that, I give her a 5 out of 5. I give her a 5 out of 5. I okay. give her a 5.5 out of 5. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Zoom. We have Demi Lovato. And I don't know why she didn't perform at the actual... Yeah. She performed, but oh, in she Las Vegas. Oh, okay. In, what the, she in perform? another... Sorry, not sorry. Yeah. Oh. It was really good, but she didn't perform actually on the stage. It was really confusing, because I was like, I swear... Katy Perry did that, though, a few years ago. Did she? When she did Raw. Oh. I don't like them, because no, I like them more. Either. I don't know. Um, I don't know why they do that. No, me neither. I really love what she's wearing. I do, too. I think she looks cool. I think she's got this whole J-Lo thing going on at the minute. I see it. I think she looks hotter than she ever has at the moment. Agreed. I think the bottom, the trousers look a bit of our dream of genie. So maybe that's what she was going for. I love the top as well. It's a, it's really nice. It's really, really flattering. The kind of like lace comes on, like follows the boobs. And then the abs kind of like yeah. follows the ab line. I don't know, it's just really nice. Well done, Demi. Well done. You get a 4.5 out of 5. Yeah. Okay, he is a fellow YouTuber, influencer -y type person. He gets in drag and he has makeup, um, but he looks really good. I love him. And the sass is everything. He looks so cool. I love the one glove, like Michael Jackson as well. Uh, I like the no uh, shirt under the blazer. I like the the fringe that is coming off the blazer as well. And I love the high-waisted trousers. Yeah, everything about it is just what I would aspire to. Androgynous. Yes. yes, queen. For this. He gets a solid 5 out of 5 from me. He gets a 6 out of 5. Ooh, you can't keep doing that. I can do what I like. Okay. <laughs> Next up is Lord. Yas. Do you like? I love. I like. Yeah. Yeah. She apparently she was poorly. She was poorly. She was ill, she had the flu. Um, I, which is a shame. Yeah, I watched her performance. I did tweet about it and that tweet went a bit everywhere. I watched her performance about 5 minutes ago and I completely understand that she didn't sing because she was ill. But I kind of also think we should well, have given that spot to someone else. Maybe you could have given that to like someone else. Maybe Taylor Swift or... I, I don't think Taylor Swift would have went if Katy Perry was hosting. That's probably why I shouldn't go. Still, like... But still, to another artist who could have done a performance. Yeah. Or to Julia Michaels who they decided to cut off 30 seconds into her bloody performance. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Instead they decide to watch Lord France on stage. Literally. <laughs> Which, I, I'm not mad about it. It just could have been something else. <laughs> I do like her dress. I think she looks very pretty indeed. She looks very glam. Um, she looks very nice. I wish her hair was different. Yep, I give her a 3 out of 5. I give her a 3 out of 3.5 out of 5, let's do Stop doing the points. I like it. Stop doing the over 5s. I can do what I like. Okay, we have our high school musical queen, Vanessa. 
I and like this little yeah. number. I love it. It's really cute. It's different. Yeah. I do like, you can't really see, but it does actually come up, the mesh. Comes oh, yeah. off her neck. Oh, yeah. There. Um, but I do really like that. Yeah. And the part of me wishes that it actually fell to the ground. I know it's fun having it kind of like swish around oh, like and it. at the ankle, but I think it would look cool if it hit the ground. Then I just a thought. I like I like her hair, I like her dress, I give her a four. I give her a 4.5. Okay, we have Haley Steinfeld, and I usually obsessed with her looks. Um, this time is a no go for me. Really? I'm really upset. Why? Because I think it's nice, but I think it looks really messy. Not her, not her hair, not her accessories. Literally the dress for some reason just looks like a gigantic ball of mess, even when I was watching it live. It just kind of doesn't look like everything is in the right spot. Like it just looks like bits of fabric coming off it. And True. I don't know, it could have been better. The color's nice. I don't think it's terrible and I think she looks cute. Yeah, it's not terrible. Um, but I just, yeah, it's just like another mer. I give her a 2.5, sorry. I give her a two. I love how a two is like your medium and a two is like my, yeah. like horrible. <laughs> we have Fifth Harmony who look like Four People cousins that have who, never met before. Yeah, just come together for a family photo. I like some of them. Some of them. And actually, by some of them, I mean. Actually, I don't like any of them. <laughs> I mean, I like the whole black ensemble there. I think her boobs, for some reason, look really high. Yeah. And I said that as well. I couldn't understand why her boobs look like they were up to her bloody chin. His, I, I like Fifth Harmony. I love their music, and I think they. They're great, but I just don't like their dresses. I think when you, it's all right if you're turning up separately in the band, but I think when you're together, I think yeah. you kind of have to resemble, not wear the same thing, of course. Well, usually you do. You wear something of the same color to kind of show that you're a group. Yeah, I know they don't have to obviously show because people know, Yeah, but I think they look com just completely different. They just don't go together and it's yeah. kind of sad. Yeah, the, the shorter one, Ali. Um, sure. I think her dress looks like a six-year-old dress about who's 12 going to a her birthday party. Yeah, yeah. it's her birthday party. She's 12 years old. She's waiting for her Barbie that she wanted. I just can't. I can't. Yeah. The one, the whole white ensemble is nice as well. Yeah, I like um, that. But as a whole, I'm going to give them a 1.5. Uh, the black ensemble, I'm gonna give a three. I'm gonna give them all a one. Okay. <laughs> Sorry guys, but it's the truth. Again, we love her. We love Kesha, but... we really do. And we know that she's- And she can kind of do what the fuck she wants. She can, and but we know that she's put on some weight. Um, and she's obviously known she's put on some weight because she's trying to hide it in this dress. But the thing is, when you wear frumpy stuff, it makes you look frumpier. And the colour kind of blends in with her hair. It and does. Like and it doesn't like... Yeah. It's fine. It's perfect for when you get a dress that you want to have just under your boobs that goes out. Because yes, it hides your stomach. But then when you have the top half, it's just as chunky. Yeah. It just looks like a giant suit of armour. I actually don't like the dress at all. I think even if someone else wore it, I don't like it. If I think it was that, the bottom frills are really nice. Mm. And I think if it cut off there and then it went into like a tighter silhouette. Yeah. And maybe some really light kind of like arm mm. thing she's trying to do, it would be a lot nicer. I just think the top half ruins it. I think if you have put a little bit of weight on, there's nothing wrong with that. And I no. think you should not show it, but like you should kind of like- Figure out your curves and how to work them. Embrace them and wear sort of like things that for curvy, you know, like yeah. be sexy. Don't try and hide it with something that's twice the size. Exactly. Um, Whoever put her in this, you need to fire your stylist <laughs> because they've done a bad job, a really bad job. And I'm mm. sure with all the success of your- well, Maybe she liked it. Maybe she liked it, but I was watching her sit down mm. and she was uncomfortable. Oh, really? She had this gigantic bloody ball gown that was twice the size of her. Yeah. She couldn't like sit in her seat. <laughs> but um, because Kesha, she gets one point added on, so she gets a 2.5. Two. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you would like to comment your opinions below, please do that. Or if you think we're completely wrong and don't agree with what we have said, I'm sure you'll put it down below. I'm sure you will. Um, but we like that. We like reading all that kind of thing. It's fun. That's why we make these videos. Um, so then everyone has a different style. Thank you again, and we will see you next time on this channel. Bye! Bye. Hey guys, if you want to watch another video, you can click on these ones just here, or if you want, you can actually subscribe to our channel. So, yeah, um, bye. <laughs>